Hello YouTube, welcome back to 3D printing and everything else. This is your boy DJ Hammer Boy. Welcome back to Minecraft Story Mode Episode 3 Part 2. Let's start off where we left off. Thanks. You could fit hundreds of people in here, but it doesn't look like it's being used for much of anything. Let's see what's going on behind this door. And I call that one symphony in E. <laughs> A new composition to celebrate my newest discovery. That's him! This time, I observed Soren. I place a block on top of another block. What the? <laughs> Rudimentary, yes, it's but just a recording. sign of undeniable intelligence. <laughs> I hope I'm not imagining things. <laughs> After all that, <laughs> he's not even here? <laughs> I, 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 I better eat something. I'm positively lightheaded with excitement. We came all this way, and for what? We're no closer to Soren than before. We're so close I can taste it. <sighs> I don't think so, Jesse. Unless Soren recorded instructions for how to find the Formidabomb, this is the end of the road. Who's to say he didn't? Maybe there's something useful well, on this record. My next step I can is figure to out what he's whether talking they might be about. Able to be persuaded to build collaboratively. I've mm. worked up a simple set of building instructions to inspire them. <laughs> I will disguise myself and hide among them in order to observe them more closely. Huh. Hmm. Oh, hide I among feel a new them. Composition hide among who? Uh... Jesse, do you think Soren is talking about them? No way that's what he means. That's nuts. You heard that recording. He's trying to get them to build. You think he's actually training Enderman to build stuff? I think he thinks he's training Enderman to build stuff. Let's look around, see what we could find out. Olivia, check it out. An Enderman suit? This must be the disguise Soren was talking about on the recording. In order to walk amongst the Enderman, you have to become an Enderman. Ah, oh, it smells like one, apparently. Woof. Good thing they can't see me through this glass. <laughs> Found something. What you got? It's definitely some sort of crafting recipe, but why would someone as brilliant as Soren need a recipe for a shape that simple? Because they're not for Soren. They're for the Endermen. This must be what he's trying to teach them to build. Okay, so, if Soren is using those blueprints to teach the Endermen to build, and there's a disguise missing from the stand, 
He must be conducting his experiment right now. Of course! The missing disguise is the one he had to put on before going outside. Which means if we want to get to Soren, oh, we have to go out there to do it. That leftover Enderman suit would fit me. Guess it's time to play dress up. How do I look? I don't think you want my honest opinion. But it just might do the trick. Those instructions called for clay blocks, just like this one. I'll take this one too. Hang on a second. Soren in disguise looks like any old Enderman, and so will you. How are you going to find him? Walk up to every Enderman out there and say, Hey, are you Soren? The whole point of the disguise is to avoid that kind of attention. Soren's trying to teach the Enderman to build the shape in those instructions, right? I bet if I complete it, that would really get his attention. Try not to die, okay? I'd really hate to have to watch that from behind this protective glass. Thanks for the vote of confidence. Okay, we've just gotta get Soren's attention and avoid attracting theirs. Cracked it yet? Not yet, but I'm getting closer. That's three I've grabbed so far. Okay, let's try this again.
this one too. Enderman Observations, Part 27? I've been watching the Enderman up close. Totemic Constructions of Peaceful Enderman. Hmm. Could Enderman be implored to work together? The Folly of Pumpkins? Wearing a pumpkin may stop the... Calls of the Enderman. creepy, right? Huh? The Ender Suit. I keep wanting to not look at you. It's so disturbing. I'm sorry. You go ahead and build with those Endermen outside. I'll just wait here. find anything useful? <laughs> Worth asking. Lock down, five to go. I just hope that Soren's watching wherever he is. That's everything I've got. Guess I gotta find another block.
looks like this is the last block in here. Evidence of Enderman intelligence accomplished. Uh, nothing to see here, guys. Just walk away. Okay, they're not walking away. Definitely not walking away. I am sorry about this, but it has to look real. I I don't think it'll bruise your face. I these suits were built with durability in mind. You must be Soren. Well, I am. But must I be? I'm not sure if I want to sometimes. Where are the others? Your friends are stomping around, uninvited, making a mess, I'm sure. By the way, as far as introductions are concerned, this is not going very well. We're in danger. Oh, what else is new? Whatever your issue is, whatever your problem, it has occurred before, and has been solved before. Even so, what do you need me for? I've gone out of my way to avoid these types of problems. I don't even remember what it looks like up there. We've come all this way to ask for your help. I never invited you. We need the Formidabomb. There's a wither storm on the loose and it's eating the world. Ah, I see. You misspoke. You don't need me. You need my stuff. I've found that when you give people what they want, they turn on you. They become resentful. Who turned on you? All of them! It's why I prefer Endermen. They always do what you expect, almost to a fault. You're a stranger. And what you're asking for is too dangerous. I'm sorry for tricking you. That is what you did, isn't it? I needed to get your attention. Well, you have it now. Gabriel asked me to reassemble the Order of the Stone. The Order of the Stone? They asked for me? I've always known they needed me, but I was never sure if they wanted me. Gabriel is your friend. Hmm, I don't know. Does he ever talk about me? Uh, sure. What kinds of things do they say? Specifically? Give me an example. I can't think of any specifics, but they've said nothing but good things. Good things, yes. But what about you? Are you my friend? As long as we're on the subject? Sure. Ah, that's the best thing I've heard in years. Admittedly, it's not a very high bar. Don't worry. I'm going to help you, because that's what friends do. Before we leave, I'm going to give my old friends a gift. The gift of song. Gary may seem scary, but he's a swell guy. Sally dilly dallies, give her credit she tries. They might look the same to the untrained eye, but that's a lie. So I say... What's happening? Wait, is that... Are, are, are you? Soren! Whoa! You look... terrible. Terribly handsome. <coughs> Hello, old friend. We've been looking for you. Seems a bit odd. They've never been inside before. Look away! You've upset them! You've 
altered their behavior. Okay, let's go. And the hits just keep on coming. Huh? I wasn't expecting so many house guests. There's no way I have enough seashell soaps for all of them. How are we supposed to get out of here? We need to come up with a plan. We just have to muscle through them. One constant about Endermen is that they hate water. If we can force that fountain to overflow somehow... Jesse, you still have the Enderman suit. Put that on, and you'll be able to safely reach the fountain. Oh, just when I thought I'd never have to smell this thing again. Good luck, dude. We'll, um, all watch from here, then. Where it's safe. gonna die. Ah. Nobody's gonna die because I'm going to break that other fountain. Okay, everybody, let's go! Uh... What's the holdup? <gasps> They're everywhere. How are we supposed to get through this? I mean physically and psychologically. Keep your eyes down, everyone. Grab on to me. I guess if this is the only way we're gonna make it back to the trap door... about how flammable my building material was. So I installed a fire suppression system to prevent the whole thing from going up in flames. 
so there's more water? Much more. If we activate it, it could disperse all these Endermen while we swim to safety. Can we reach the controls from here? The lever! It's right up there! Yeesh! this thing is going to kick out, so everybody... It's working! Well done, Jesse. Now, time to swim to that trap door. Quick, come on. Hurry! Jesse! Jesse, hurry! We made it. Making it is relative. Oh, come on! This isn't a ton of fun, but let's grab that permit bomb and get out of here! One small problem. I mean, really? This could all be them. I haven't actually built it yet. That's a small problem? You seem like a person who appreciates cool stuff that's cool for no reason. Thanks? Go ahead and throw that letter behind you. Jesse! Hold on to your socks, because they're about to get blown off. Go to work, boys. Attack us, will they? Ask me no questions, and I'll tell you no lies. That didn't actually... Ask me no questions! Do you guys hear that? The what? All that stuff whispering. Take me, take me now. I think it's saying... Olivia should get to take more than Axel. I know this is cool, but the only things we need in here are the ingredients for the Formidabon. The loot says you're wrong. I'll just fetch the Super TNT. It's right up there. How are you going to get up there? Well, I have my ways. Oh, and feel free to help yourselves. Just make sure you keep an eye out for the gunpowder we'll need to make that formidable. This concludes Minecraft Story Mode Episode 3, Part 2. Please like and subscribe and share for more. Part 3, coming soon.